Okay, hello everybody today. The question is, put on your thinking cap. Do the creatures which are in the sea, do creatures which are in the sea have the breath of life in them? Yes or no? We read in uh, Genesis, the book of Genesis, and we have in the book of Genesis, chapter 7, it says, verse 21, And all flesh died that moved upon the earth, both of fall, and of cattle, and of beasts, and of every creeping thing that creepeth upon the earth, and every man. All in whose nostrils was the breath of life, of all those that in a dry land died, so I love Ken Ham. Ken Ham, I think uh, Ken Hovin for me is the, the best. Ken Ham is very, very good, maybe the best also, because they're younger Christians, they're defending the Word of God. Even though they're not Seventh Adventists, they will soon, hopefully, become Seventh Adventists, which is the only true organization of God on the earth today. Nevertheless, uh, Ken Ham was doing a debate yesterday with Bill Nye, the evolutionist. The debate was very profound, the arguments of uh, Ken Ham was very good. But I think during a uh, part of the uh, talk he said that the creatures in the, in the sea do not have the, the breath of life in them. If we read closely here in uh, Genesis 7 it says, uh, All was in nostrils was the breath of life and all that was on the dry land died. So here is not saying, uh, Genesis 7, 22, is not saying that in the sea this, the creatures have no breath of life. He said that when the flood happened, when only eight people on the earth chose to not to follow the crowds, the gangsterism and the hate and the pride and the, and the violence and the selfishness and the me, 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 and the, and the, and the men's opinions, they didn't, they didn't choose to follow the the rulers of this earth telling them what to do. They chose to follow a book, the, the Bible, rather than, than have the, the, the TV set become your Bible. The TV set becomes Bibles. Many people and they and they, they think that what they watch on TV becomes truth to them. Truth. It becomes truth to them. Or the or the these eight people didn't die in the flood. They chose not to follow their opinions, their instinct, their intention, the the what the things that come into mind, the impressions they have. The impressions and the feelings, impressions, knowing that most of these things do not come from God. Your personal opinions, feelings, sensations come from the devil. The devil can impress in the mind, impress things in the minds of people. The devil impresses many things on the kings of the earth to do evil things. The devil impresses Hitler to do things. It's not just him. Don't think that Hitler did bad things and this guy did bad things. No, it's people who were impressed by the devil to do these evil things. Coming back to our story here, it says that all the, the, the creatures who had breath of life in them and who were on the earth died. Does this mean that the creatures which are in a sea have no breath of life? If God wanted to destroy every creature on the earth, why did God kill only those on the earth? That's a good mystery. <laughs> we don't know. No one knows. Man. I don't know. The Bible says that the, the hidden things belong to God and the revealed things belong to us. The Bible is only maybe a drop of water in a sea of knowledge of God's, of God's, of God's intelligence. Let's go to the seven trumpets, seven trumpets in Revelation chapter 7. And we have in Revelation chapter 7, it says, no, no, Revelation chapter 8, Revelation chapter 8, it says, verse 9, Revelation 8, 9, and the third part of the creatures which were in the sea, and had life. In the French Bible it says, and had and had breath of life. And had breath of life 
died and the third part the ships were destroyed. Revelation 8, 9 tells us that uh, spiritually what happened during the time I think of uh, some of the tribes that came to Rome to invade Rome spiritually it says that one third of the, of the person that lives in the sea died without breath of life. Yes, the whales and the dolphins they have the breath of life. 